Hello everyone, this is Moshe, the electric Israeli, and an icy day, everything is ice here. Anyway, so today I'm going to do a video I, that I do every few months. It's the most watched topic on my channel, gets the most views, is uh, how to buy and where to buy a used electric car. So as you know, electric cars are, uh, if you put them next to their equivalent uh, in gasoline, they are exponentially more expensive. Uh, even the cheapest Nissan Leaf is about $30,000 uh, and then up and up and up and there also there's an issue of availability not all electric cars are available everywhere so that's why when I do an electric car a used electric car a guide how to buy and, and where to buy is usually I pick a, a Nissan Leaf Chevy Volt Chevy Bolt EV and Teslas because they are the most available meaning Oh, most of the electric cars that were ever produced in the United States are those four kinds. Now, there are a lot of others, but they're not produced a lot, so therefore, there's not too many used of cars of that brand. So, let's, so just like I said, so electric cars, new electric cars are more expensive than a, a gasoline equivalent in all categories. However, they do have a federal tax incentive, a state tax incentives, and so on. Tesla already lost half of the federal tax incentive, and Chevrolet and GM is about to lose in a couple months there. So you see that even those incentives for those brands are now going away, slowly, slowly. Nissan still has it. So let's start with where to buy. Now, always, always, it's safer to buy a car from a used car from the uh, manufacturing dealer so it, it's good to buy a Nissan Leaf at a Nissan dealer because you get some kind you get some kind of an, they have expense inspections and you can get a warranty for some parts if you'd like to extend so it's always easy you know what you get you have what I call a mother and a father so that's always better but the uh, the downside is you will pay more it's more expensive so you can buy from somebody from Joe Schmo yes you can do that but it is risky you know there's a lot of con artists out there okay so I said especially Tesla's I would not buy a Tesla from a Chevy dealer or from somebody unless it's your friend and you know who that is and all that so but prepared to know that you're taking a risk if you buy it from a private seller and it is going to be uh it, but it will be less expensive probably probably you don't know all right so that's number one so number two where do you find them okay you can go to your local dealers and find or or to the tesla store and find or you can find them online there are so many uh, website used car websites uh, cars.com carvana.com uh, car facts and uh, kelly blue book and car cash you name it you you put used car on google you will not know where to start and when to it there's so many of them and if you are there already i will look for uh, uh cars that are on dealers lots because dealers do advertise those uh, uh, their used cars on those websites so that's a step in the right direction so you can do that uh, as as far as tesla again you can find teslas by private sellers or by um what do you call it by uh at, at dealers but i will stay away from those guys i will stay away you can go to the tesla website and go to used inventory so let me give you some numbers just because i do searches like this all the time and i'm a nice guy so i do this for you uh so for example here's a leaf uh that i found this is from carvana i believe uh, 20, 2015 leaf the one that i just sold not too long ago between 11,300 to 11,800 40,000 miles plus that's for the base model so it's very very inexpensive that those car that car the car that i sold the leaf that i saw and these cars can go for i don't know for five more years easy very little maintenance very little headaches if you buy it from a certified dealer and you make sure that you get good tires and everything is good you should be driving this commuter car for a long time remember the nissan leaves not the 2018 the, up until 20 and 2015 or so uh, those are commuters 80 85 miles uh, so that's 
great. That's a fantastic. For $11,000, you can run it, run errands with it for many, many years to come. Here's a Chevy Volt. A Volt also a t tremendous availability. Here's a 2016 for 19400 with 19,000 plus miles, okay? Again, I have a Chevy Volt, uh, three years. I have 60,000 plus miles. The car is a beast. It's gonna go for many more years to come. 50 miles of electric range. Okay, so if you if you buy a Chevy Volt, I would buy the 2016 and up with the bigger battery. So you, ha you will do a lot more EV um, driving. Fantastic car. Chevy Bolt EV. 240 miles of range. That's not a commuter anymore. Here's a 2017 for a little bit less than $24,000 for 21,000 plus miles. You know how long that car will go? You get my you get my drift, right? You get my theme. So now, if you don't want to hustle with a new car and tax and tax forms and all that, you can buy that car. That this Volt, this Bolt is basically half price from a new uh, uh, from new world because they lose tremendous amount of their of their uh, value once you start driving them which is bad for the seller and good for the owner and good for the buyer the new buyer so you can get fantastic chevy bolt for half price literally half price Teslas, like I said, I highly recommend to go to the Tesla website and go to use inventory. You, you can put your um, uh, zip code and it will tell you in your area. So you don't have to pay for shipping or drive far away to get them. You can get them within 100 miles from where you live. Here's a 2013 and, or 2014 uh, um, uh, year for 37,500. Okay, for uh, uh, 85... Um, uh, for 85 kilowatt battery, the big battery, 72,000 plus miles. Here's a 60 kilowatt battery with 61 uh, plus thousand miles. So, like I said, again, these cars we require such little maintenance. And if they, if you buy it from a certified dealer or from the Tesla uh, uh, store that has all this inspection, and if you're willing to buy, to pay a little bit more for uh, extended warranty, you can enjoy these cars for years and years to come. Years and years to come. And you are in the EV market, which is a wonderful, wonderful thing to do. You would love, I mean, Chevy Bolt, my God, when my son needs, a, that's the one I will, my second, my younger son, I will get him a used EV, that'd be great. What do you need, what do you need something more than that? You know what I'm saying? Okay, guys, that's that. So uh, go ahead, go do your search, go find, go buy. It's wonderful. A used EV, it's a wonderful idea. Thank you, guys. If you have any questions, let me know. Meanwhile, don't forget to subscribe. Help me change the world. One used EV at a time. <laughs> and I'll see you tomorrow with another video.